play much faster than they did last season and expect Sabonis to be involved on both sides early. Yeah, De'Aaron Fox with a sprained ankle. Hopefully he will be back shortly. Our Audi starting lineups with Steph Clay, Andrew Wiggins, Draymond, and Kevon Looney. Wiggins attacking early and is the second leading scorer in the NBA. Draymond Green opens with a three. Now the last time the Warriors were in this building championship year, it's the easiest bar bet. Who led the Warriors in three-point shooting when they won the title? Andrew Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins, not Steph, not Clay, not Jordan Poole. It was Wiggins. He was the second best player on the Warriors. Davion Mitchell for a sidestep three, and that curls in. Want him shooting contested threes. Kevin Herter opens on Steph, but we saw that double team in Sacramento. Draymond has hit two threes. Draymond Green was like, hey, I'll take that shot. I'm good with it. So again, doubling Steph. How do you make Sacramento pay? And how about Wiggins on a tic-tac-toe with Looney, the middleman? But Wiggins isn't sitting on the three-point line. Go ahead and cut in there. They're going to find you. So many great passers on this team. Davion's trying to beat De'Aaron Fox. It's a lot of dribble penetration, but the Warrior defense knocking it away. Steph in transition, weaving through traffic, floating it up and in. Curry giving the Warriors the 12th first home game after a long road trip, but not if you get off to a good start. Draymond again. I was going to say the building was getting ready to, to rumble if he had three in a row. He earned the heat check, though. I'm good with it. Davion Mitchell. Perhaps in the rebound. Clay's been more attentive on the glass in the early going this season. It's been nice to see. Just adding parts to his game. That backdoor pass. Good hands, Clay Thompson to lay it up and in. That's the movement without the ball. Herter thought he was going to set that. Especially if he's going to gamble like he did on that Steph one. He didn't get the steal. And Steph recognized, okay, I got him now. Early part of the year, but Sabonis after the $217 million extension. 18 points, 15 boards, 6 assists. I mean, he really is just elite, elite as a hub, as a big offensively. And you get the sense he's still hungry to get better. And he's wanting to sure up his mid-range game, the three ball. So if anyone wants to gap him, like the handoffs and the way they want to cut and move it out the ball, he's the reason they can do that so well. Steph Curry for three, around and out, and Herter with the rebound. I liked early as the Warriors are scoring in bunches. It isn't all threes. A lot of attacking the basket. That's the way it's been. They're actually second in the league in percentage of points that come off a of mid range. So they're taking what the defense gives them. Wiggins knocked it away, but it ricochets right back to Sabona. And Looney having two fouls now. Got to be a little careful the next couple minutes that he doesn't grab a third one. It's going to be done for the half. Wiggins sensing a seam right to the rim. Beautifully done. It hit Steph's double teams again. It was kind of a loose double team. He got rid of it early, and again, Wiggins cutting inside and not staying at the three-point line. Keegan Murray led all rookies in threes last year. Missing the shot there. He's got a wrap on that right hand, though, and I don't know if that thumb is bothering him. His percentage shooting had not been great the way he wanted it to, but he's going to keep shooting. Clay Thompson inside the three-point line. That's beautiful. It would have been a tough three for Clay. Force it. Got a defender taking away the three ball. Go inside. Very high level first half of the first quarter for the Dubs. Everything came together nicely. So Chris Paul and Dario Saric with their first playing time. Clay Thompson hitting that three. Games in four nights are both in uniform tonight. And if Clay wants it, he's got that curl all the way to the rim if he wants to keep going. That was a tough shot he made. So bonus on charge. Now we skip pass. Wiggins returning it to Clay. Just short on that three. Neither one of these teams wants to slow it down. It's going to be end to end at Herder. Red Velvet lasering. Steph getting his first seated action. Colby Jones in the game. Second round pick out of Xavier. Sabonis with a nice block on GP2. Jones taking 34. Malik Monk attacking and nearly fired it out of bounds. GP2 the steal. Charge in a foot race and he'll win it to lay it in. Rebounding is key. And GP2 kept Sabonis off the glass. He couldn't get it, but then someone else was able to jump in there. That's team rebounding. GP2, the little big man, putting it up and in. GP2 is so good at screen.